to all our participants.
to all participants and stand up. The program is about to start in the future. Pagdating ng araw, ang iyong buhok ay puputin na rin. Sabay tayong mga harap ng makaraan natin. Ang nakalipas ay ipabalik natin. Ipapaalala ko sa iyo.
round of applause for Mr. Butch Salazar. Thank you, Paul. Thank you very much, Miss Janeline Angeles. Cheeks so 
you please arrange it? Cause I love you Just the way you look tonight Oh, and I love the wrinkles in your nose. It touches my foolish heart. Oh, never leave, don't you? Ever, ever change Keep that breath in it strong Won't you please arrange it Cause I love you Just the way you look tonight Just the way Thank you very much, Mr. Odwin Alviar. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our first ever Red Mass Gala, live from the monochrome. The President and CEO of the Medical City, South Luzon, will give us his opening remarks. Let us welcome Dr. Cesc Espirito. Welcome to the Red Mask Gala, Walk the Runway for a Cause. Tonight's event is held in celebration of World AIDS Day and to raise funds to help provide care and support to children with HIV. It aims to focus our attention on a medical and social affliction a lot of our members of society are still uncomfortable with. People with HIV AIDS are often burdened with its stigma and often suffer from discrimination. We hope that with continued education, more will realize that HIV patients are like any other member of our society who deserve the understanding, care, 
and support for their disease. I would like to commend and congratulate the organizers of this event, the HICEC Department, or HISEC, of the Medical City South Luzon, headed by Dr. Mark Christopher Pasaya. I would like to thank all of you who have extended their generosity, both in time and finances, to back this important cause. Those of you who are in your seats, excited to see your favorite friend or relative try his or her hand at walking the ramp, the support crew behind the scenes, and more so, the models who are living their dream and probably are both giddy and nervous. Finally, let us not forget that tonight is all about having fun. So let's all enjoy, clap, cheer, shout, and make this event a resounding success. At this junction, to tell us exactly what this event is all about, let us also hear it coming from the Chief Medical Officer of the Medical City, South Luzon, Dr. Jesus Julio Ancheta. I'd like to share how all this program has started. Okay. Uh, when I started my practice in Santa Rosa, this was actually my dream. As a young infectious disease specialist, when I came to Santa Rosa, I said, why don't we start our own treatment hub? So the years went by, came Dr. Mark Pasayan, Dr. Monica Montesilio, Dr. Mike Crisostomo, and one of our new infectious disease specialists, Dr. Mark, another Mark. So came, together with him, is starting up our own treatment hub. So it's actually a dream come true for me as Chief Medical Officer of seeing this. But what is more better than starting off a treatment hub is what we have learned with this pandemic, not only with HIV, the pandemic of COVID-19. We started joining hands and working together. So with this, we came up with a lot of things. I think this is going to be the trademark of TMC South Luzon. The fast and the first. The fast being able to put up the complex of hope and respond to the needs of the pandemic at that time. In a few days, we were able to start off and create a separate hospital for COVID. And here came the infectious disease specialist headed by Dr. Mark Pasayan who in a couple of weeks decided to and ask us, what do we do with the World AIDS Day together with the treatment hub? This was sometime early November. So here we are celebrating World AIDS Day with a wonderful and beautiful people of the medical city South Luzon and Santa Rosa and everyone who has been involved with this project. So with this, I would like to thank our guest. First, with the representative from the Office of the Governor, Dr. Jose Odilon Inosilio, the Chair of the Public Health Services of the Provincial Health Office. And of course, all of you know, our chairman of the Medical City South Luzon, Chairman Jose Juliano. And our CEO who will join us in the runway, Dr. Jun Juliano. And last but not but least, our ever beautiful Mayor of Santa Rosa Laguna, Mayor Arlene Arcilias, whom I would like to thank everyone for their generous contribution and their beautiful gowns and clothes to celebrate World AIDS Day and help stop and end the pandemic on AIDS. Thank you and good evening.
December 1, 2021. Tonight, we step on the runway. Take a deep breath and focus on a point in the distance. Because every step you take is an opportunity to end inequalities, end AIDS and pandemics. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Our first group of models is named 1981, the year of the first reported cases of HIV. History continues until today, where advances in HIV prevention, care, and treatment offer hope to people who are living with or at risk of having HIV or AIDS. Honorable Mayor of the City of the Santa Rosa Laguna, Mayor Arlene B. Arcelias. Midnight in the morning coffee, burning through the hours talking. I like me better when I'm with you. I like me better when I'm with you. I knew from the first time, I stayed for a long time, cause I like me better when I like me better when I'm Where the room yeah, I got no ceiling If we lay let the dangers pass us by I might get to too much talking Dr. Angelo Lozada Damn. I like me better when I'm with you I like me better when I'm with you I knew from the first time I stayed for a long time cause Mr. Gus Avesilia. Mr. Helder Tiomico. From the first 
Dr. Sue and Kua. Mr. Nico Saloza. It's been 24 hours, I need more hours with you. You spent the weekend getting even. Ooh. You spent the late nights making things right between us. Mr. Lloyd Joshua Bellagio. For the last time, yeah. Maybe I know that I'm drunk. Maybe I know you're the one. Maybe I'm thinking it's better if you drive. Not too long ago, I was dancing for dollars. No, it's really real if I let you be my mom. Once again, group 1981. I'm sure that mother girls were nice enough, but you need someone to spice it up. So who you gonna call? Party, party, come and rev it up like a Harley, Harley. Why is the best food always forbidden? I'm coming to you now. Over the limit, the red light, red light, stop. stop. I don't play when it comes to my heart. Let's get it though. I don't really want a white horse in a carriage. I'm thinking more white horses and carriage. I need you right here, cuz every time you fall, I play with this kitty like you play with your guitar. Cause
City, where patients are partners. This phrase finds its full meaning when patient is viewed not as a problem to be solved, but a partner in their own health. Ladies and gentlemen, our patient partner models. Dr. Mark Joseph Castigliano. Kate Picayo. Tell me that you're coming through. Ooh, you're so sweet, so sweet, so tight, so tight. I won't bite uh -uh. unless you like, unless you like. If you smoke, what you smoke? I got the haze. haze. And if you're hungry, girl, I got the lace. That's be Dr. Rocky Danilo Willis.
Dr. Grisanta Willis. Dr. J. Sunday Marie. Dr. Alma Joy Vitera Maureen. Once again, our patient partner models. Access to healthcare and opportunities for growth must be provided for people who are otherwise be excluded or marginalized. Let's welcome our models who advocate inclusivity. Dr. Catherine Grace Juliano Remolino.
our chief pharmacist, Miss Annabelle Porta. Simonette Velasco. Stephanie Huko Christine Juliano.
Dr. Jose Enrico Juliano. Once again, our inclusivity model. Our next so group so sweet. But now she of models is named U equals U. U equals U is also a part of the international campaign to raise awareness about an aspect of HRV ART. It means that someone with undetectable HIV viral load cannot transmit HIV. U equals U. Dr. Michael Chrysostomo. Oh, I'm so cold, I'm so cold. You got me out here. Smoking up the window. Singing, how could she do this to me? How could she do this to me? Oh, I thought Dr. Regente Lapa. Dr. Earl Richardson Chu. Dr. Amando Rafan.
Dr. Jude James Espejo. Doctor Jenny Lynn Juhuri. San Diego. Must have spent 35, 45,000 up in Tiffany's. Oh, no. Got a badass kids running around my whole crib like it's Chuck E. Cheese. Whoa, whoa. Put me in the jam with an X Men in the UFC. Can't believe it. I'm in disbelief. This bitch got me. Once again, our U equals U models. Like we're 
ensuring that every individual, no matter their background, has an equal chance to make the most of their lives and talents is the battle cry of our next set of mottos. Equality. A club isn't the best place to find the lovers so of the bar is where I go. Dr. Mark. Me and my friends at the table doing shots, tripping fast and then we talk slow. And you come over and start up a conversation with just me and trust me I'll give it a chance. Now take my hand, stop it, and the man on the jukebox and then we start to dance and now I'm singing like girl you know I want your love. Your love was handmade for somebody Dr. like Dr. Mark me. Christopher Fasaya. Dr. Margarita, evidente. Now my bed sheets smell like you. Every day discovering something brand new. I'm in love with your body. Oh, I, oh, I, oh, I, oh, I. I'm in love with your body. Oh, I, oh, I, oh, I, oh, I. I'm in love with your body. Oh, I, oh, I, oh, I, oh, I. I'm in love with your body. Every day discovering something brand new. I'm in love with the shape of you. When we can, we let the story begin. We're going out on our first day. Mm -hmm. You and me are thrifty, so go all you can eat. Fill up your bag and I fill up the plate. Mm -hmm. We talk for hours and hours about the sweet and the sour and how your family's doing okay. Mm -hmm. And even get in a taxi, kiss in the backseat, tell the driver, make the radio play. And I'm singing like, girl, you know. Dr. Angelica love. Joy, Alante, Lorenzo. Like me. Come on now, follow my lead. Maybe crazy, don't mind me, say boy, let's not talk too much. Grab on my waist and put that body on me. I'm coming now, follow my lead. I'm coming now, follow my lead. Mm -hmm. I'm in love with the shape of you. We push and pull like a magnet do. Although my heart is falling too. I'm in love with your body. Last night you were in my room. Now my bed sheets smell like you. Every day discovering something brand new. Mr. Ruskin Gecko. Miss Mary Joy Zulueta. Dr. Vicente Fermalo.
Dr. Virginia Alva. Dr. Maria Gina Nazareth. Once more, our equality models. Our final group of models are walking the runway tonight, declaring an ambitious future for everyone. And inequalities, and AIDS, and, and pandemics. Let us welcome our end AIDS model. Dr. Jesus Julio Angeta. Olarte Pagkalinawa
Dr. Christina Marquez. Dr. Arabella Pua King Dr. May Claudine Gosoko. And finally, Dr. Monica Pia Reyes Montesilio. And once again, our end AIDS models. Zoom attendees 
for watching us in the comfort of their own homes. Hello! Hello, Doxes! Ma'am Melanie! Hello po! I'm Sharon, my Dr. Amy Viridiano. Hi! Please turn on your um, cameras para makita po namin kayo. Please wave at the cameras! Hello po! Thank you very much for watching us through Zoom and In 2021, on the average, there are 33 people newly diagnosed with HIV every day. Compare that to 10 years ago when there were only six cases per day. A quarter of these reported cases are from our region, the Calabarzon. Based on the DOH model for HIV prevalence, nearby cities and municipalities like Silang, Binyan, Cabuyao, Calamba, San Pedro, and Santa Rosa are all Category A, which means these areas have high number of HIV cases and are prioritized for HIV intervention. What's also alarming is that one-third of the reported cases are aged 15 to 24 years old and half are 25 to 34 years old. We need to intervene and do something to address the HIV epidemic. We need to prioritize intervention among key populations. We need to scale up effective prevention and treatment programs. That's the goal of the Medical City South Resort, to create a center where linkage to diagnosis and treatment and where continuum of care and support for people living with HIV are provided, regardless of age, gender identity, ethnicity, and social status. This is the crest of TMC South Luzon. We are at the point where decisions are made, actions are taken, and changes are delivered. The crest that represents each and everyone's ideals to put patients at center stage where healthcare is free from prejudice and pretense. It is an honor present to you the crest at TMC South Luzon. And now for the turnover ceremonial check of the ceremonial check to Duyan Foundation. Let's call on stage Dr. Mark Christopher Pasayan, Dr. Jesus Julian Cheta, and Dr. June Juliano. Pasensya na po kasi medyo ano po eh, sobrang busy this day dahil sa World AIDS Day since morning po, early morning. Marami na po akong mga talks and engagement po. Uh, Ipag-pray nyo po kami, ang aming grupo, ang aming mga ba anak na araw-araw po ay patuloy na lumaban. Lumaban hindi lang sa sa, sa kanilang mga katayuan, kanilang health, ano, kundi sa mga taong nakapaligid, sa, sa stigma and discrimination. Uh, maraming maraming salamat po at naging part po kami ng inyong, ng, ng gabing ito. Sana po, hindi lang dito magtapos po, ang, ang gabing ito ay maging eye-opener para sa lahat upang patuloy po nating ibigay ang ating puso, lalo na sa mga taong namumuhay ng may HIV. Maraming salamat po at God bless us all po. And now to receive the ceremonial check to Yakup, may we call on stage Dr. Montesilio, Dr. Crisostomo, and Dr. Marky Castellan.
YACAP stands for Young Adult Care Assistance Program. Thank you very much. And now on behalf of the Um, yeah. um, on behalf of um, the, the whole um, Medical City South Ozon, the Hospital Infection Control and Epidemiology Center, um, I would like to express my deepest, deepest gratitude to everyone who participated, who donated, who gave their support, um, their, um, their help for these children, and uh, for spending time with us, you no, know? um, we never thought that this will be this big. We, when we, when we planned this out, it, it was just a small activity. Now we planned na in front of the hospital. Remember, dun sa may Union Bank, dun lang dapat yon, or sa likod sa may tapat ng COH. But uh, because of our very effective team headed by Miss Lirio here um, and Claude. You know, uh, we'll, kaya pala, kaya pala namin at a very short time, sabi nga Dr. J. And of course, with all the support of everyone, not just from TMC, but also from um, other hospitals, from different organizations. We have Dr. Nazareth of PCP, uh, Dr. Chris Marquez of Laguna Medical Center, and Laguna Medical Society. So, again, thank you so much. And uh, the night is still young. Uh, there's an after party after this. And this event will not be very, very possible, of course, without these people <laughs> around me, Dr. Marky, Dr. J, uh, Dr. Michael Sosomo, and of course, the Monica Pia Montesilio. <laughs> Again, good night and magandang gabi po and enjoy the rest of the evening. Thank you very much. Our IDSS. On behalf of the Honorable Governor Ramil Hernandez, a message will be given by the Chief Public Health Services of Laguna Provincial Health Office, Dr. Jose Odilon Innocent, Inasilio. Uh, yeah, um, good evening po sa lahat. Uh, of course, si Governor Ramil Hernandez po would like to be here sana, kaya lang nak masyado talagang maraming schedule na nagpapatong-patong po ang ating governor kasi the past three days po ang ating National Vaccination Day ay talagang rumampa po ang Laguna. Sa tulong din po, syempre, ng the medical city and laki ng contribution po. Uh, first and foremost, of course, I would like to greet Dr. J.N. Cheta, Chief Medical Officer, Dr. June Juliano, uh, Chief Operations Officer, Chairman Jose Juliano, Chairman of the Board, and of course, uh, kanina si Mayor Arlene Arcilias. Magkasama po kami kanina sa blessing naman ng vaccination sites sa Laguna Techno Park. Uh, if you would allow me, ito po yung message ni Governor Ramil Hernandez uh, ngayong gabi. Ang World AIDS Day ay nakagawian, nakagawian ng idao sa bansa tuwing ika isa ng Disyembre bawat taon. Ito ay isang pagkakataon para ang lahat ay magkaisa sa paglaban sa HIV. Upang ipakita ang suporta para sa mga taong may HIV at upang gunitain ang mga namatay mula sa isang sakit na nauugnay sa AIDS. Itinatag noong 1988 ang World AIDS Day ay ang kauna-unahang pandaydigang araw ng kalusugan. Isa itong malinaw na indikasyon ng ating suporta at pakikisa sa pinagdaraanan ng mga individual at mga pamilya na naapektuhan ng sakit na ito. Sa Pilipinas, isa pa rin ang HIV-AIDS sa mga pangunahing public health issue na ating tinututukan. Lalo pa at sa kabila ng maraming information campaign, Tungkol dito ay ang HIV prevalence sa bansa ay tumaas ng 207% per mula 2010 hanggang 2019. Ito ay ayon sa datos na nakalap ng Joint United Nations Program on HIV-AIDS 
Noong 2019, tinatayang 97,000 katao ang nabubuhay na may, na may HIV sa Pilipinas. Kaya naman hinihikayat ng pamahalaang panlalawigan ang lahat ng maging bahagi ng mahakbang laban sa HIV AIDS. Mahalaga ang partisipasyon ng lahat sapagkat mga naapektuhan ng sakit na ito ay madalas nakakaranas ng kakulangan sa kinakailangang AIDS services upang magawa nilang i-manage ang kanilang karamdaman. Sila ay nakakaranas din ng diskriminasyon mula sa mga taong walang sapat na kaalaman ukol sa kanilang kondisyon. Hayaan ninyo akong kilalani ng lahat ng bumubuo sa The Medical City sa kanilang hakbang na mangalap ng pondo para makapag-ambag sa pagbibigay ng tulong sa mga bata na may HIV sa ilalim ng Duyan Program ng Project Red Ribbon at IREAC. Maraming salamat sa inyong malasakit at kahandaan na makaisa sa, laba, sa laban sa sakit na ito. Umasa kayo na ako at ang pamahalaang panlalawigan sa pamamagitan ng ating serbisyong tama para sa lahat ay laging handa na sumuporta sa inyong mga inisyatibo para sa kaligtasan at kalusugan ng bawat Lagunense. Rise High, the medical city. Rise High, Laguna. And on a personal note, mula po sa Provincial Health Office na aking nire-represent, ay marami po talaga mga programa sa health ang na-sideline ngayong pandemic. Pero isa po sa mga tinututukan ng Provincial Health Office ang programa na makakatulong para sa ating mga persons living with HIV. Kaya po nung unang batch ng bakunahan, ay marami po tayo at karamihan sa mga PLHIV natin dito sa Laguna ay isa sa mga una nating nabakunahan. Maraming salamat po dito sa Medical City, sa inyong HIV Hub, napakalaking tulong. At lalo na po sa pandemic na ito, ang dami niyong binabakunahan, ang dami niyong natutulungan. At gusto ko lang pong ibalita sa inyo, na 2 to 3 months ago, ang Laguna ay nasa 13,000 plus ang active cases natin per day. As of yesterday po, at 12 noon, 181 na lang ang active cases natin. At isa pa pong magandang balita, sa nakaraang tatlong araw ng HIV, ng HIV taloy, ng COVID-19 vaccination natin, nangunguna po ang Calabarzon sa buong Pilipinas sa pinakamaraming nabakunahan at sa Calabarzon po, nangunguna ang Laguna sa pinakamaraming nabakunahan. At napakalaking tulong po ng The Medical City po para marami tayong mabakunahan dito sa Laguna. Kaya po, tuloy-tuloy lang po ang ating laban. Mula sa Provincial Health Office, gusto ko lang pong ipabatid sa inyo na a pandemic of this magnitude entails a lot of commitment from all of us health workers. Do your part. However little it is, it matters. Have a pleasant good evening. Thank you po. Maraming salamat po muli, Dr. Jose Odilon Inesilio. At this junction, let us hear the recorded message from the mayor of the city of Santa Rosa, Mayor Arlene B. Arcelias. To my colleagues and friends in the health sector, especially the medical city South Luzon, a pleasant evening to all of you. It is an honor for me to be a part of such an important event in celebration of World AIDS Day, the Red Mask Gala. The assistance that we will be able to provide to the Duyan Craving Children with HIV program makes us even more remarkable. As someone who has always put people's health and well-being first, I pledge my complete support in situations like this. Not only that we do assist selected beneficiaries, but we also create awareness for others. Congratulations and thank you to everyone who helped organize this great and significant night, as well as everyone else who helped make it happen. I also appreciate your unwavering support in our fight against HIV AIDS, not only tonight, but every day. As we come to a close for the evening, I am delighted to join in this effort to promote awareness, unify, and show our support for individuals living with HIV AIDS. With this, I can say that the city of Santa Rosa and the medical city South Luzon are on the same page when it comes to putting healthcare first. 
Let us join together to end the stigma and instead educate others and remind those who are fighting this sickness that they are not alone. We will fight with them and for them. Thank you very much. I'm looking forward to celebrate more events like this. Stay safe and God bless. And for the final word for tonight, may we call on the Chief Operations Officer of the Medical City, South Luzon, Dr. Jose Enrico Juliano. Good evening, everyone. Are you still here? Do you want to, to do it again? Oh, come on up. <laughs> Rampa ulit. Thank you, everyone, for gracing the event and making this a very, very memorable celebration for us. Uh, really, at the start of the year, we didn't know what will happen. We survived two surges again, and we came out stronger. We are winners. And I give everybody the kudos, the congratulations for a job well done. Let us raise our glasses to each other and also in remembrance of our friend our colleague who has passed away okay but today tonight is a it's a night of happiness a night of celebration a night of fi figuring out that your shoes still fit you that your souls are still going strong Kasi we never had this chance to wear our best ever before for two years. And now, seeing everybody in a nice tuxedo, coat, gowns, seeing all the beautiful faces, the women in their beautiful makeup, and the men in their rubber shoes, I'm overdressed for the men, but for the women, I think it's going to be a very, very hard time taking off the makeup and the dress at the end of the day. The guys will have just to jump into the bed and sleep. Madali. But again, thank you very much for a night and a good job well done to the organizers. Though we are celebrating HIV and I thought it was hair is vanishing, it is not mine to give pala or to take. It is for the AIDS awareness. To, to the people, the young people who are still here, enjoy the night. The food is free. The liquor is still bountiful. Again, thank you very much for gracing. We look forward to the next event. And that is by next year, no more masks. I pray. Thank you. Good night. Thank you very much, Doc June. And now, to wrap up the night with an electrifying performance, let's turn our heads to the nurse supervisor on duty, Miss May Rizapal. Just like a circus. 
There's only two types of guys out there The ones that hang with me and the ones that are scared Oh baby, I hope that you came prepared I'll run a tight ship, so beware I'm like the real leader, I call them shots I'm like a firecracker, I'll make it hot When I put on a show I feel the adrenaline moving through my veins Spotlight on me and I'm ready to break I'm like a performance and the floor is the stage They'll be ready, I hope you feel the same More eyes on me in the center of the ring just like the dance when you crack the whip Control nurse Nathan Binoya. Thank you very much for attending and enjoy the rest of the evening. Good night.